I'm David Carnoy, executive editor for CNET.com, and I'm here with the Philips iPhone 5 dock. This also goes by the model number, the DS1155. Philips made a previous version of this with the 30-pin connector, but this has the lightning connector, so it does work with lightning-equipped iPhones and iPods. However, this dock does not fit any sort of iPad. It's obviously very small. It's compact. Uh, it has a built-in clock, which is nice. However, there's no alarm. However, you can use your iPhone's alarm, so that's not a huge deal. What I liked about it is its design. I uh, also reviewed a JBL unit. This is a little bit sleeker looking, that unit, but that JBL OnBeat Micro uh, sounds a little bit bigger. Um, it also has a little bit better feature set than this. For instance, there's a USB port on the back of this dock, but it's really only for charging another device, such as another smartphone. Um, you can't stream audio through that connection. The other kind of cool feature worth mentioning here is that there's a bit of lighting on the bottom of the unit. There's a few LED lights, and so it gives off a sort of yellow glow. You can turn it off or you can leave it on at night, uh, but it kind of gives it a nice, cool halo effect. As far as the sound goes, it's fine. Um, it does play bigger than you think it would, uh, but compared to that JBL OnBeat Micro, this one offered a little bit thinner sound, didn't have quite as much bass, and it wasn't quite as clear. So in terms of pluses, if you're thinking about buying this, this does have a sleeker design. Uh, it does cost slightly less than some of the new Lightning-equipped speaker docks out there, but its sound quality is a step below the JBL. I'm David Carnoy, and that's the Philips iPhone 5 speaker dock, also known as the DS1155. Thanks for watching. Thank you.